don't know what this is. It's freaking no! It's a TV! Oh, I got it, I got it. Oh, Maybe geez. not, that's where our alligator's at. Hey y'all, welcome back. It's Adventures of Me. Today we're gonna be doing some magnet fishing. It's another day of the clean stream movement. So let's go check out our spot and see what we got. Here is the bridge. There's one side right there and another side here. So let's look over the side of the bridge real quick. Look at that bank over there. Oh my gosh, do y'all see that turtle right over there in the water? I've seen a bunch of turtles, but they keep dipping under the water. And then look at that tire right there. And then just a bunch of trees and stumps. So we're gonna try hard not to catch those trees because that's how you lose a magnet. Look both ways. We're gonna cross the street to the other side of the bridge. Alrighty, this is the other side we're working with. Holy cow, oh my gosh. Do y'all see that under the bridge? Let's go take a closer look. Oh my goodness. Is that like a box or something with a fan? And then like some type of motor thing? I see a tire, but holy cow. I'm gonna go grab my magnet and gloves and take up comb throws and check that stuff out. Let's take our first throw of the day. Woo! Oh, we got some on a first throw. Let's pull it up. Oh my goodness, what the heck? It's like, it looks like a side piece and then this bent piece of metal right here. Hey, that's not too bad for our first throw. Oh my gosh, can y'all see it? There's like oil and stuff down there. There's oil in the water. Oh, let's get that out. I can literally look down and see a lot of trash in this water. It's so sad. That's a hose or something. That hose is stuck under some other things. Oh my goodness, we're gonna have to come back for that hose and try to get some other stuff up. On this row, we got a sheet of white metal. We got this little plug in the wall thing. It says line right there. Load and then line. No clue what that is, but solid piece of metal right there. Put that in the bucket. Oh, 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 we got something on our magnet. Oh my goodness. It's like giant cornflakes of metal. We're just pulling pieces of metal off of something that's in the water. Oh my gosh, there's something big out there. Oh! That we click on something, we click off something, we end up with something else. We clicked on something again! So let's check this out. We got, we got a little cap thing. It looks like you put on the end of a pipe. Full of mud right there already. And then the other stuff is just some corn flicky stuff. And then this weird looking thing. This one is weird. It's like it has a pin and screws things behind it. And it's such a weird shape. Oh, it's like a, I don't know, piece of something. It looks like a pin or something. Or like some type of badge. I'm not really sure. It looks like it could be gold. We got that thing. Oh, oh my gosh, we got a couple sticks. Oh, we lost a stick. Good, good, good. And it looks like duct tape or something. Grody. So we got some duct tape, really old. That's pretty nasty. And it was wrapped around a piece of metal. I don't know why that would be wrapped up in duct tape. Ooh, we got a little something on our magnet. Ooh, ooh, ooh. ooh it's breakable metal. We gotta put this in our blue bucket, all little scraps. Okay, there's something straight down. We're gonna see if we can get it. Or see if it's magnetic. It's not magnetic like I thought it was. That's awesome. Yeah, Thank you. Ooh, I just sat on something really big. Oh gosh, there's a lot of bubbles. We got some metal on it. And a shotgun shell. Let's check it out. We got this curved piece of metal right there. And we got this nice little, it looks like it goes to part of a sign right there. Let's put it in our bucket. Oh, it does smell nasty though. Oh. There's something big out there. I'm gonna try to pull it slow, see if I can get it. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, this is really heavy. Emmy's got something big. All right, go slow. You got a stick on there too, so go slow. No! Oh, no it fell off. All right, just get okay, it. Okay, I gotta get this thing that I got so yeah. far. There's something huge on it. This is a pipe of sorts. This couldn't be a gun barrel, could it? I don't think so. We got something, we got something, we got something else. It's a big cluster of stuff. Is that a sign? 
Oh, I grabbed it. We got this white piece of metal right there. It goes in the bucket. We got a curved piece of metal right here. Not sure why it's curved, but we got it. I'm gonna put that in the bucket. And then we got a signpost right here. No sign attached. But then there's potential that there is a sign in that water. There's also some cam lids on my magnet. It says, lift tab to break seal. I wonder what type of can that is. Interesting. But we're gonna put those in the bucket. Going straight down. Oh. Oh, 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 we got something big and heavy. Oh, what is it? Oh, no! Oh, I got this weird silver looking thing oh here. Gosh, but I just lost a box. So oh, thing. it just so broke, but this silver piece of metal right here might go to a car or something. Not super sure. We got a nice oh, corn flake of metal no, right there. The Putting it in the bucket. Bryce just asked me to grab a claw from the car, so I just grabbed a claw for him because he got something big. Looks like a stove top on his magnet. Yeah, man, I was right. It is a stove top. Whoa. Look at that. Bam. You can cook some food on that, Bryce. Right. Well, we're missing the burner part, so that means there's probably a whole stove in there. I'm going to go straight down because I got something big right underneath me. Straight down. Oh, oh, I think we got it again. Yeah, like oh, my gosh. Bryce, bring the claw. All right, I guess they just got a thing against computers over here. And you got a shotgun shell on that floor too. All right, you'd probably do better on my side. All right, I think we got it here. I'm scared this metal's gonna rip. We got it. Oh. We think it's a computer right there. Computer on it? Not a monitor, but. No, I think that's a computer. I really don't know what that is, but the only thing kind of, this wires, would be the bottom of it then. And all sorts of neat stuff in it. And it's square like one. It looks a little old and a little rusty. We also got a shotgun shell on that throw. It says reduce recoil. Remington. Oh, it's a Remington. And it's closed. This one hasn't been I shot. Know. Whoa. That's cool. I think we got it here. It does look like a of some sort. Oh man, that is gonna be a pain in the butt. I'm gonna tell it. you that. We got the DVD player. Let's check it out. You can see the batteries in it right there. And then here's the cable and stuff. And it's still got the plug on it. No, that kind of looks like a stereo with the twisty bob doodles. Why would it have batteries when it's got that though? I don't know. I don't know if there's a battery in it. I don't know, they are. Well, Bryce has my magnet because our magnets are stuck together at the moment. It's gonna be a pain in the butt to get apart. Two magnet throw right there. Whoa! Oh my gosh, that thing's so freaking heavy. Mint container. Check that out. Yeah, whatever the heck this thing is, I don't know what that is. And this big old thing right here. Is that a shock? Maybe. Yeah, you know what? That probably is a shock. How do I do this? Do not step on the rope. It will take you with you. I don't believe get it that. Wrapped around your arm. Okay, so. Don't step on the rope. Two magnet, two ropes. <laughs> <laughs> Well, there you, go. you actually did better than I thought you did. It went just as far as my normal throws do. <laughs> Make sure both ropes are on the same. Both same ropes. Way. This is like reins to a horse. I don't recommend this. Right there. Right there. That looks just like a freaky gun. Oh. Oh, she's gonna need help. <laughs> All right, let me take the next one. I need here. the claw. Gun now. Is it a pot? That's like a rice cooker. Cooker right there, a crock no, pot. It's a crock pot. It's a crock pot. <laughs> you gonna make some chili? There we go. Oh, chili sounds really good. <gasps> I got a fan. You got a fan? Man. Look at this fan. Popped it open. A knife now we got a fork. Now we need a spoon. Usually Ooh. the. Uh, Ow! Oh, sorry. You just hit me with a fork. Sorry. So fresh and so clean. Usually we find more spoons. Here's the fork that just hit my leg. Thanks, Bryce. Oh, I got my magnet back. Let's go. Woo! Oh, there's a dead deer. Ew. Oh, that's creepy as crap. I'm moving away from that dead deer. We're gonna get these right here. Like this is already might as well be out of the water. It looks like another computer. It is another computer, it looks like. One computer. That's the second one of the day. There's a box what right is that? there. Is that a, just a box? Is it a safe? I can get it on the side there. That's a fish tank. Oh. Oh, it's a fish tank. I thought that was glass. Oh, 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 oh. There we go. I don't know what this is. It's freaking. No. It's a TV. All right, let's go slow. You got it. Check out that really old TV right there. Wow. It says Panasonic right there, on and off right there. Holy cow, any TV experts out there? What decade is this TV from? Drop it down in the comments, let me know. Woo! Holy 
Holy cow, that's a big pipe. We gotta go slow. Whoa! Go slow. Let's get it past the bridge. Holy cow! Look at that pipe! This is a funny looking pipe right there. Got like a joint thing right there. We're gonna have to add this to our pile. Yeah. Holy cow. There's so much stuff right underneath me that my magnet clicks on and clicks off of different stuff. Check this out. We got... Oh, wait, we got a watch. It's like Tommy Gerber or something. Like the watch face is full of water. What time is it set to? So that's 12, one, two, three. It says it's 11, 15. That is, I think my first watch, holy cow. Look at the back of it. It says Tommy Hilfiger, water resistant. I think it's past water resistant now. Bryce said he needs help. Yeah, can you hold this? Hold this? This? Yeah. It's a dual exhaust for a car. Oh my goodness. Oh, alas are you. Come here, magnet cowboy. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Gotta mess with it. A dual exhaust. You know what? I'm gonna go like this. All right, look at that. That thing is heavy, man. Whoa. That is totally an exhaust system for a car. Check that out. Dang. You gonna add this baby to the 4Runner? Oh yeah, for sure. Oh, you mean add it to the 4Runner? No. Right, get it's, got, up. it's got the wrong tips. Good teamwork. <laughs> Tommy Hilfiger watch. This <laughs> That's definitely is fake. Is this a real watch or is it a ripoff? But it looks like it's a made for a female. Like it would go right there. Hey, it's the first watch of our magnet fishing fashion right here. Let's go. Oh, check this out right here on our magnet. Looks like it goes to something like a computer board or something. Whoa, look at that. Definitely old, definitely electronic. You know the things that make machines and motors go? It looks like one of those little boards with wires and paths on it. That is pretty cool. Woo! We got something. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Gotta go really slow. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, I got it. I got it. That was hooked onto the top of the magnet. See, look, it's a square right there. That looks like it's probably a sign post or something. Oh. oh my gosh, my magnet is clicking on different things. Look, it loses one thing and it picks up another thing. Barely have a sign on. Oh my goodness. Look at this, y'all. We just got a sign barely on the magnet. It is bent in, or it could just be a panel to like a stove or a dishwasher or something. We're gonna add this to our pile. We got more piece of power line. I don't know what this is. Yep, yeah. it's another car exhaust. Is it a converter? Yeah, can you see a fancy converter? Really? Oh. He thinks this is a catalytic converter. He says it's gonna be worth like a couple hundred dollars in the scrapyard. Look, there's a VIN number on it. Is there? Oh shoot. It says Ford. Yeah, it's a Ford right there and there's a VIN number. Dang. Whoa. All right, it's a little bit heavier. What is it? I know there's no way, oh my, is this a freaking cannonball? Oh my gosh, my heart is pounding so hard. Yo, it's like heavy enough to be, it's about the size of my hand. I don't, I do not see a fuse on this one though, but it could be one of those solid shot cannonballs. All right, let's get it. I'm currently driving the car with the trailer and Bryce is loading all the stuff into the trailer. There's a combine right behind me. There it is. And there it goes. That is huge. He took up the whole bridge. Oh my gosh, she would have squished us. Good thing he was nice and went slow and we moved out of the way. Take a guess of how many pounds this is. Tomorrow we're gonna go to the scrapyard because today it's closed. So we just got to the police station and they just called out a deputy to come check out the potential cannonball that we have because there's potentially explosives in it we did not bring it inside the police station but we are getting someone to check it out so to see what it is yeah no, i know i just i i looked at it i'm not too familiar like i want to make sure there's no like views on it i figured i'd run it past it all first just in case hmm. i'm gonna go back out tomorrow i mean that's I don't think you gotta worry about it blowing up. All right, yeah, that, that's what I'm looking no, for. No, I don't think so. We, we, I ain't gonna say 100, percent but I think my body's out there. Oh man, seven. I don't want to. I've, I found enough dead deer from probably people. Poaching. Maybe not. That's where our alligators at. Yeah, they, it was spotted again this summer. Really? Laying right there on huh. the road. 
<laughs> That's interesting. I hope y'all enjoyed today's adventures. See you in the next video. Bye!